All right. What's up, everybody? If you follow Friends to the Full Lawn, you guys know that we were helping a family. Uh, came on one of our live videos that um, basically homeless, living in a burnt out uh, trailer with just a little bit of electricity, no running water. And uh, we've been helping Kelly and uh, Danny out. And their next door neighbor had a puppy. And uh, we went up there the other day and I told the guy, I said, that puppy's gonna get hit by a car. Well, the puppy got hit by a car and he can't, he can't walk. So, uh, this is Chip. Hey, Chip. Hey, baby boy. You're okay. Uh, not paralyzed, he's wagging his tail, but he's in a lot of pain. So, uh, Rebecca came and, uh, picked me up and brought me up to Dalton because I'm on medication for my back and I shouldn't be driving. So um, we've got this dog hit by a car. We're gonna try to find room for him. We're getting him to the Dr. Leathers. And I also got a mother dog at Paulding County with four puppies that got hit by a car with a, a broken pelvis. We're trying to find a foster for her. So guys, it never stops. If you're able to, please hit that donate button. This puppy's going to need some blood work and some x-rays and some pain pills. And who knows what else he's going to need. Um, we'll let you know. This is his uh, kind of freedom ride. He's four months old, I believe they said. So uh, we couldn't leave him there. We're full. We don't have a we don't have room for him, but we'll make room somewhere. Um, we're not going to leave this little puppy uh, injured like that. So, he's okay. I mean, he's, he's in pain. We touched him, he peed all over the place. Right, Chip? Hey, buddy. You okay? You all right, buddy? I know, you're hurt. So, uh, guys, if you're able to help out, please hit that donate button. We've taken on so much lately, and uh, it just never ends. We have another mother dog hit by car after this that we have to try to place. So if you're able to, hey Janet. My buddy Rebecca came and picked me up today because she didn't want me driving because I'm medicated for my back. So we're about an hour and a half away from uh, Dr. Leathers getting this little pup um, over there. We'll at least alleviate some of his pain. We'll figure out what he needs. Uh, we don't know who's taking him yet, Nikki. We just couldn't leave him there. So, maybe you take him. Um, he's four months old. Can't use his back legs right now. He yelps in pain when you touch him. Hi, buddy. You wagging your tail a little bit. Hi, boo. You say hello. You love your dad already. What are you doing, Chip? You good boy? He's a good puppy. Hey, puppy. You good pup? It's going to get better, buddy. I promise you. Yeah, so four-month-old little pup. This is what happens when you let dogs run loose. Um, if anybody wants to hit the donate button, start it off, it would be great. We're going to incur some, co uh, some costs here. Like I said, we were up in Dalton helping this family out. They called us, uh, the dog got hit by a car, the next door neighbor's dog. So we're rushing them over to Dr. Leathers. Rebecca doesn't try to kill us driving. Uh, Rebecca came and um, picked me up, and brought me all the way up to Dalton, drove way out of her way, and because uh, uh, 
I'm on, the, I'm on some muscle relaxers and pain pills for my back. Patricia, thank you. Bridget, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, um, I'm hoping nothing's broken. He's just banged up, but he's not using those legs. We had to pull him out in the cart and lift him up. Rebecca put him into the, the car here. Keith again came through. Thank you. All right, guys, I appreciate it. Memory, thank you. Uh, go on our website, fill out a foster app. We need fosters so badly if you're local. Thank you, Stephanie. Yeah, we're going to take care of the baby. You know that. Like I said, we're full. We don't even have a place for him right now. But I wasn't going to leave this dog up there in pain. Uh, the guy lied, said the other night. We were ready to go up there at midnight. Rebecca was going to come to my house, pick me up. We would have got up there about midnight after the live video. They lied and said that um, they were taking him to the emergency hospital and, uh, in Chattanooga. And they never did. And I didn't find out till last night that uh, he was still sitting there. So Rebecca came, picked me up this morning, and we drove up here. Lisa, thank you. I appreciate it. Kelly says thank you uh, for taking me. All right, guys, we're going to get this pup over to Dr. Leathers. We've got a hour and 20 minute ride, I guess. But I'm sitting in the back with him. I got my uh, my bodyguard seat warmers on. and my, my chauffeur, <laughs> my bodyguard, my consigliere, my wartime consigliere right here, Rebecca Grooms. She's uh, on vacation, so she gets to drive Jason and the injured puppy around all day and Provide me with black Dunkin' Donuts coffee and bottled water. <laughs> and seat warmers. <laughs> so everybody say thank you, Rebecca. She's my bodyguard. Lisa, we appreciate it. Thank you, guys. If you can, hit that donate button, guys. There's 65 people on here. If everybody just sends in 10 bucks, should help us out. I don't know what's going on with him. We'll, we won't know till we x-ray him. Uh, he's not critical seen a lot worse what the fuck is wrong with people <laughs> a lot i see this shit every day we have a mother dog at paulding that we're trying to find the foster for with four puppies about four weeks old and she got hit by a car and uh she's got a broken pelvis but that mom is still feeding those puppies we're gonna try to take her in today oh uh, thank you emma maybe we'll start a uk branch <laughs> everybody's thanking you rebecca <laughs> And she did her hair today for everybody. She wants to know she did her hair for everybody. Shut up. Yeah, he's a good little puppy. Little Chip. His name is Chip. Thanks. Thanks, Ann. I'm, I'm breaking Rebecca's chops, but Rebecca's always willing to help out. She fosters and adopts for, adopted from us multiple times, volunteers. And uh, she's a good friend. And she goes for Chinese food with me which is always a plus. We go for Thai food and Chinese food. Everybody's thanking, thanking you. Everybody, yeah, thank you for putting up for me. Regina, thank you. Thank you in Columbia, South Carolina. We love you. Rebecca has family there. They all have the same hairstyle. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta have a little fun right guys Leah thank you all right guys we're getting there eight people have donated we got 66 people on this is little chip we met little chip when we were helping a family out um, Terry thank you thank you um, you're very welcome no need to thank us this is our job this is what we do Thank you guys for supporting uh, our mission. But we were helping the family out. We brought them some clothes and some food and some supplies. Uh, they're living in a, a dilapidated trailer. And uh, we're gonna help them with their dogs, but their neighbor's dog was running around the other day. And I told the guys that this puppy's gonna get hit by a car. 
And sure enough, he did. Ashley, thank you. Lynn, thank you. Um, appreciate the donations. So this puppy got hit by a car. The other day we were uh, live and they told us that the puppy got hit by a car. We were gonna go up there at midnight. I had to finish the dogs and Rebecca was gonna come drive an hour and change to my house, pick me up and bring me up there at midnight. But they told us that they were bringing the pup to the emergency hospital. Um, the guy never did. So found out about it late last night. So we're here today getting this dog. Nikki just donated. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. This is little Chip. He's not feeling too good. He got blasted by a car. They said the car was going pretty quick. So I'm hoping the damage isn't too, too bad. We got him on a nice comfortable blanket. I'm sitting back here with him. He's got his heated seat on. Both of us are in pain. Don't worry about it, Susan. Just wish us well. If you're not working, no need to donate. Charity starts at home. But if you're able to donate, hit that donate button, send in 10 bucks. We got 58 people on. Um, help us out. Like I said, we've got another mother dog that was hit by a car that we're trying to rescue. No, they signed them over. They signed them over. We got them. I don't know where I'm going to put them. Thank you, Aaron. But no, he's uh, he's staying with us. And thank you, Aaron. Thank you. What's up, Nettie? Hey, Brenda. You guys are just logging on. You guys know that we've... Uh... Beth, thank you. Thank you for all the love from uh, England. We love you too. You guys know my back's been out for a few days and I'm... Uh... I'm medicated, so Rebecca didn't want me driving all the way up to Dalton. So she did a hair and she came out to pick us up. <laughs> Thank you, Erin. And this is little Chip. He got blasted by a car. They said it was going pretty fast. Um, he ate and drank. They said he hasn't pooped yet, but that's going to be uh, painful for him. Ginger, thank you. So we're full. I don't even know where we're going to put him yet but he needed to get to the vet and that's what we're gonna do. And I promise you, he, he'll, be, he'll be with us. So welcome to the family, little boy. We got you. Andrea, thank you. Appreciate that. When you're able to help, you should. If you're not able to help, just wish us well. Hey, buddy. You hanging in there? Huh? Daddy's here. Daddy's here. I got you, little boy. Oh, little baby. Little Chip. They say he's about four months old. Thank you, Andrea. Appreciate it. So if you're just tuning in, Rebecca and I are on the way back from Dalton. We've been helping a family. It's going through a rough time up there, bringing them some supplies and some food and some clothes and some toiletries and some dog food. And then next, to, next door neighbor had a puppy. And the puppy was hit by a car the other night. Where uh, he's unable to walk. Um, I don't know the extent of the damages, but he's, uh, he's okay right now. He's eating and drinking. Um, we're getting them over to Dr. Leathers. We don't have any room for them. We've got a mama dog after this that we're working on that got hit by a car. Uh, thank you, I appreciate it. I appreciate it, thank you, thank you. Hope everything's well in Florida. Hope you guys are okay. Hopefully you come visit soon after this is all over and uh, we get to eat something again. Nikki and her family are good people. They're all dog lovers. But we're getting little Chip to the vet. We got about an hour to go. Rebecca's driving like 90 miles an hour. She's a mad woman. That's how she did her hair. She opened up the window. <laughs> Sorry, I'm under the influence. <laughs> Rebecca's driving me around because uh, I'm, I'm pretty messed up. My back is pretty bad. Julia, 
Oh, oh Julie, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, Nick, I don't want to move him around from place to place. We got to get him uh, stable. You got to stop traveling. All right, guys, there's 53 people on. If you're able, 55 people, if you're able to, send in 10 bucks. This little pup got blasted by a car. We're rushing him to the vet. We don't have any room for him or the next dog. What's up, Steph? If you're just logging on, this is little Chip. He's not feeling too good. He got blasted by a car up in Dalton. He belongs to the neighbors of the family that uh, we're helping up there, Kelly and Danny. And uh, guy said he was going to take the dog to the vet two days ago and never did. So this pup's been sitting here in pain for two days. So we found out about it. Um, Rebecca's came and picked me up. Drove us up to Dalton, put the dog in the car because my back is out and I'm on meds and she didn't want me driving. And uh, we're racing over to Dr. Leathers. I think the speedometer says 140. She's out of control, this lady. Look at her, 140. <laughs> she gave me the finger. <laughs> Thank you, Vanessa. I appreciate that. So if you're able to help out, please do. Um, we're getting this little pup over to uh, Dr. Leathers. Like I said, I don't think there's anything critical. I don't think he's bleeding internally. Um, I think he got blasted pretty bad. Uh, I think he's in pain. Thank you, Julie. Vanessa, we appreciate you guys. Just hit that thing for 10 bucks. I know we keep asking for money, but look at what we keep doing. We don't stop. We don't have room for this dog. We don't have room for the mama dog and four pups that were hit by a car at Paulden, but we're gonna find a place for him. Um, it's just been non-stop, guys. Non-stop. But we appreciate you, Julie. So if you're able to, guys, hit that donate button on there. This is an emergency little freedom ride for Chip. Chip was blasted by a car, and uh, we're getting him over to the vet. Well, thank you. Thank you, Patricia. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Joanna. Crystal, thank you. Appreciate it. Yep, Rebecca's the speed racer. You got that right. She's nuts. She's cutting everybody off, driving on the shoulder on the wrong side of the road, spilling my coffee all over the place. Oh, thank you, Julie. I appreciate that. Tara, thank you, thank you, thank you. Guys, if you're able to, just took on an emergency. This little pup was hit by a car. Um, can't move his back legs right now. Thank you, Robin, our real estate agent and friend, foster, and cat finder. Cat yeah. <laughs> she finds these evil cats with their, with their kittens rabbit animals and she brings them to Rebecca <laughs> oh god Rebecca just ran like seven people off the road there goes that family whoops the whole camper just went off the road what's in the cup black coffee uh, I'm trying to stay awake those the meds that they gave me are knocking me dead I'm in a fog so I'm not responsible for anything that I say live I'm being chauffeured around Rebecca, the cops have been trying to pull us over for 15 miles. She's running them off the road, shooting at them. That's not a wig, that's a hair. <laughs> She's gonna kill me when we stop. She didn't have time to drive a hair. She's been running from the police. They've been trying to pull us over for 20 miles. Rebecca's doing about 140. I think she's under the influence. Zach, thank you. Thank you, buddy. Hey, Don, thank you. The men are showing up today. I appreciate that. Oh, fuck my back. Oh, I know how you feel, little buddy. I feel like I got hit by a truck, too. Rebecca wants me to get hit by a truck. If there was an eject button, Rebecca would throw me out. I'm pretty sure of it. It's okay. Oh, there goes another family off the road. Shit, Rebecca. 
She's running everybody off the road here trying to save this dog. I think she's wiped out 15 families. It's okay. It's all for the dogs. You guys are just tuning in. We're coming back from Dalton. As you know, we've been uh, been helping a family out up in Dalton. It's going through a hard time. Brought them some supplies and some clothes and some dog food and some human food and um, they called us. Their next door neighbor's puppy got hit by a car. And he said he was gonna bring it to the hospital and never did. So uh, they called us, signed the dog over and we're on the way to Dr. Leathers. Joanna, thank you, thank you. Yeah, Steph, um, Rebecca's body count's getting high. But we don't even know if Rebecca's really her name. I think she's wanted in like 14 countries. She's, uh, yeah, she's, uh, she's crazy. Yep. 5'2", about 90 pounds, soaking wet, and uh, she's driving like one hand, she's nuts, she drives with one hand this girl, she's in the SUV just knocking people off the road, yeah she's wanted, she's wanted in 14 countries, yep, Steph I speak the truth, She's running everybody off the road. She doesn't discriminate. She got a bicycle before. Ran them off the road on purpose. Trying to get this puppy to the vet. We're on 75, trying to make our way back to Baldwin County to Dr. Leathers um, with a puppy that was hit by a car. And he looks to be stable. He can't move his back legs. They said he was howling in pain all night. But he's a good boy. Daddy's got you, buddy. I chip him. We don't have room for him, but we're going to find room. And I also got a call from Animal Control in Paulding County. They've got a mother dog that was hit by a car with a broken, broken pelvis. And then the next day they found four of her puppies. So we're going to try to get her, try to find a foster for her. Um, Nick, did anybody respond to that? Did anybody respond to that uh, post in the Foster's group? Renee, thank you. Oh yeah. Nikki, Nikki's going away to Ocala again. Nikki never stays home. The world traveler. She's the blues traveler. Nikki Diamantis, the blues traveler. All right, guys, if you're just logging in, we're uh, heading to Dr. Leathers with a puppy named Chip. He's about four months old. He was hit by a car a couple of days ago and uh, they told us they were gonna care for him, but they never did. Um, I'm not driving. Rebecca's driving. She's out of control. Look at her, she's nuts. This woman's a maniac. I'm never getting in the car with her again. Hitting speeds excess of 150 miles an hour here. Shut up, Rebecca. <laughs> <laughs> you got to have a little fun, right? Steph, if you have some place to separate those dogs, um, you might qualify as a foster. Fill out an application. The girls will call you. I don't hand the fosters. They don't let me near people, only on video. Jenny, thank you. I appreciate the donation. Yeah, so if you're able to help, then you should. And that's the way that we live here. We never stopped. Um, little Chip got blasted by a car the other night. They told us they were providing medical care for him and they didn't. So Rebecca picked me up. What's up, Brenda, how are you? Rebecca picked me up because I'm under the influence of some medication for my back. And uh, drove all the way up to Dalton now we're driving all the way back so we're trying to figure it out we'll get it we'll get him a place to stay and we got a mama that was hit by a car with four puppies with a broken pelvis so we're probably gonna be back on later 
Brenda, thank you for the donation, hon. We appreciate it. Yeah, it's always sad. These dogs, they don't do anything to deserve this shit. Every day these dogs are suffering. We just try to make it a little better. Thank you, Ariane. Appreciate it. Hey, Heather. Yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll see if you qualify, Steph. We have some strict requirements, but we'll go for it, you know? We gotta come out, do a home visit, things like that, but I appreciate it. We'll, uh, we'll check it out. I don't handle the applications. The girls do, but um, they don't let me near anything administrative. I suck. The only thing that I can do is go live and, and mess with dogs. That's it. And uh, make fun of Rebecca. Look at that hair. Stop. In the back, you look like a snork. <laughs> She's gonna kill me. She had to leave to come get me. Oh. But guys, thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're just tuning in, we got a little bit of an emergency freedom ride. This little pup, four months old, was hit by a car. We're rushing him over to Dr. Leathers. He's a good boy. He's sleeping right now. You good boy, Chippy? Huh? You okay, buddy? You hanging in there? How's Tiny Tim? He's doing great. Tiny Tim's doing great. Eating, drinking, pooping. He beat that parvo. Um, little baby New Year's eating. Rudy, the little bull terrier, is doing great. Noelle's doing great with her prolapse. Uh, Gnocchi's doing fantastic. He's gaining weight. Estrella's taking great care of her pups. Scarlet's about to give birth. These are just some of the dogs that we've taken. I can't even remember all of them. It's been that crazy. And, Rebe and Rebecca hit me in the head oh, with something. Opal. Oh, an opal. The little Frenchie with no legs. Oh, the white, yeah, Herman. Is that his name, Herman? Is that what we named him? I don't know, something with an H. We got French Bulldogs, we've got Bull Terriers, we got German Shepherds, we have cats. What are we doing? We're going crazy. Baby New Year is so cute. So anyway, guys, if you can, hit that donate button. We got a little bit of an emergency here. This little pup was hit by a car. If you could help out, we'd appreciate it. We're on the way uh, from Dalton down to Paulding County to Dr. Leathers. They don't even know I'm coming, but doesn't matter. Nah, we'll surprise them. <laughs> Guys, please don't let the um, police know that Rebecca's here. She's wanted in 14 countries. She's driving like a maniac, running people off the road. I think she carjacked somebody for this vehicle. <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't know. I find there's there's lime in the back, bleach, <laughs> peroxide, ropes, and a shovel. I don't know if that's for me. Look at her one hand at 140 miles an hour. Oh, smiling the whole way as she runs people off the road. I think she she sideswiped about 60 troopers already. Oh yeah, and her hair. Show me her hair, hey. That's not a wig, she's really a snork. <laughs> I'm gonna get that hairstyle. What do you think, guys? I can grow hair, look, I have hair. I have hair in my ears, look. I do, I light it on fire. Nobody's grooming me. I'm a beast. I'm a beast. I could have been somebody. I could have been somebody, Rebecca. Now I'm just a, a Facebook clown. I do live videos and amuse people and save dogs. There he is, little Chip, resting. We're getting him to Dr. Leathers as fast as we can. We need a siren. 
I'm gonna get like a dog ambulance. What do you think? Hell yeah, we'll get a dog ambulance. I do have the van. That's my creeper van. That's not an ambulance. <laughs> Thank you, Steph. Steph says I am somebody. <laughs> and Rebecca's sitting there going, I'm a jerk. <laughs> well, if you're able to, guys, got a little bit of an emergency here. We got a puppy hit by a car. Like I said, after this, we're going to work um, on a mother dog hit by a car with four puppies with a broken pelvis. Oh, that's awesome. If you're able to, guys, hit that donate button, help us out. We just took this puppy on, hit by a car. We're doing some outreach work, helping a family. Um, they called us, the next door neighbor's puppy was hit by a car and he's unable to walk and he's in a lot of pain. So uh, they told us that the guy was taking it to the hospital um, the emergency hospital, he never did. They found out yesterday. Um, took the dog with them. Patricia and uh, her family brought him in. They called us. Rebecca picked me up. I don't know who that was, but if you're calling me, I'm on a live video. I'm not taking the call. They'll leave a voicemail. We'll get to it. But here we go, guys. This is little Chip. He's sleeping. He's painful when we lifted him up. He was crying. Um, he let go of his bladder. So, yeah, he's covered in pee and he's not feeling all that great. But we're getting him the doctor letters as soon as possible. Rebecca's driving. I'm in the back seat. She looks like a snort. So if you're able to, guys, hit that donate button to help us out. Help us cover some of this. I don't know what he's going to need. I'll let you know. Little Chippy. He's a good boy. Hi, Boo Boo. You all right? Yeah, he is a good puppy. He's a good pup. You okay, little boy? Huh? He's sleeping. All right, guys. I'm going to log out. Get rid of this video here. I appreciate it. I'll let you know if we need anything else for him. We're probably about 40 minutes away from Dr. Leathers. We'll keep you updated. If you're able to, guys, hit that donate button before we log off. Um, he's unable to use his back legs. There's some bruising back there. Looks like some road rash on the inner, inner leg. I don't want to move his leg. He was pretty painful and he's resting right now. So, uh, I don't think he's paralyzed. He was wagging his tail a little bit before, so we'll get him over to Dr. Leathers. We'll figure out what he needs, and we'll keep you updated. I appreciate everybody for all your support, and uh, like I said, after we get him settled, we got a mama dog that was hit by a car with four puppies uh, with a broken pelvis, so uh, we'll go from there. Yep, we got good people, Kelly. We'll do the best that we can for him. You know that. So, all right guys, my back is killing me. I'm gonna um, sit back and get off this video. I'll uh, update you later. See ya.